Hello, let me show you how we can set up private space on your Google Pixel phone. It works, for example, for the Google Pixel 8a, for the Google Pixel 7 Pro 7, basically for any Google Pixel phone with Android 15. If you don't know how you can get Android 15 on your phone, then you can also check my other tutorials on the channel. I will actually put link into the description and into the first comment under this video, so you don't have to waste your time and actually search for this specific phrase. And now, uh, if you already have this Android 15, go to the settings, move into privacy, security and privacy. Now you will have to go into private space. You can use your fingerprint recognition, you can use your screen lock, depend of your preferences. In my case, I'm going to use my screen lock. And as you can see right now, I can hide or lock private apps in a separate space. So let's actually set it up. Now just wait for the loading screen. It will take actually around a few moments. So just be patient. And after this, we'll be able to finally select whatever you want. There we go. Click that we got it in the right bottom corner. Now it's actually checking an information. And as you can see now, we have to use our Google account. So the account will be added to this device and available to other Google apps. So um, I'm gonna for sure do this, but out of the camera, just don't to leak my data, right? I mean, not even the account name, but you know, the password. So after we input your, like, you know, account, I'm not sure why I even put it out of the camera, but right now I'm going to do this to input my password. So input simply your password. And now you will have to click next in the right bottom corner. Now set up who will be using this device. So I will be using this device. Now scroll down, click I agree. Now just wait, it's actually downloading your information account and you can choose a new lock or you can use your screen lock your choice. In my case, I'm going to use the same lock as my screen lock. Now, as you can see, it's finished. So to find the private space, we have to go to app list and then, then we have to scroll down. So let's go. Let's find out. As you can see, it's right here. So we have to tap on it. I'm going to get the face recognition. And as you can see right here, we can find locked apps, like, you know, the camera, for example, uh, the Google Chrome contacts, Google Files, and other applications. You can also install some apps from this Play Store, right? So let's get, for example, the WhatsApp. There we go. Now let's wait for downloading. And now it's almost finished. So let's see if it actually was added into the private space. There we go. Now let's go back. And as you can see, yeah, the WhatsApp appears right here and the private space. So if you want to add some apps here, you will have to basically install them from the Google Play Store. Now we can log this. There we go. If you don't want to actually even uh, show this private space, you can go to the settings and hide private space and click here. There we go. And now when you did it, it's not here anymore. When you lock it, take a look. And if you search for it, input this phrase right here, private space. There we go. And that's how it works. Thanks for watching.